This is Eddie. The Knoxville Bear. He's a legend, there's no doubt about it. Well, he was one of the best players that ever lived. Eddie Taylor may be, I take that back, that may be, is the greatest all-around player that ever walked. If you, if you ask any of the players here that are old enough to remember good players uh, and say, who's the best player in the world? They won't say uh, Luther Hopsconey and all those other names. It's Eddie Taylor, first word out of their mouth. Uh, it's, it's incredible how good he played. Eddie Taylor uh, did things that mortal man can't do on table and did it consistently <laughs> you might <laughs> ta da here you go break it apart and then back to play I think Eddie should have been in the Hall of Fame a long time ago. In fact, he was my idol when I was a kid. When I was about, I guess I was about 18 years old when I first ran into him in Silver Hill, Maryland. And I watched him play there for the first time, and it was the first time I really seen a good all-around player. I had seen straight pool players, but not a guy banking balls like Eddie used to bank the balls. He just was awesome. I think he, I don't know how many balls he ran on a rope just banking balls. But he played all the games, and he had a hard, like, stone. I mean, he never failed under pressure. He was just the perfect player. I think it's wonderful and it's just an honor for the Hall of Famers to just unite with uh, just one more great. Presenting his final and most spectacular show of the end of the season, the mighty glove was the fifth in all with one single shot from the table. This one time only shows that he is a little Recently in conversation with a young man who had claimed that some other person was a greater bank pool player than Mr. Andy Taylor, the Knoxville Bear, and I just don't believe that could be true because I haven't ever seen anybody who could bank balls better than he could. I can't see with my glasses. I'm going to quit while I'm ahead. If I hadn't banked three in a row, when I was playing, I'd have been sad. And this ball has to take the place of that ball. And that's just the, the, that is the ghost ball uh, theory. Eddie Taylor, this is a long overdue honor. He's the embodiment of everything.